God. <laughs> look at the situation we're in. It's only been a week and I've already... Look at this. Good God. And we only have one herb. Okay. Look at Leon's face. He is not happy. He's like, where you been, man? I've been sitting here trying to fight off these friggin' farmers with just a grenade and a knife because you won't let me lose my friggin' gun. A little of my health is gone. Uh. Hello, friends. My name's Nick, and welcome back to Channel NES 925. It's been one hell of a week. A very up and down week for me personally. Um, like I said in the previous episode, I think. What the plan is, is we're going to continue making probably an episode every week. Because that's the only time I have right, right now. I, I happen to be very uh, free today, so I'm recording an episode. Very happy to see you guys again. How are you guys doing? I'm doing great. Hey, an egg! Thank you! I'm doing great today. Um, look at this guy. He's going on about his business like it's nothing. He, he has no idea that I'm here. He has absolutely no... Look at the guy on the left. Okay, so so the guy right in front of me with, with the pitchfork, his name is Don Esteban. And I think the guy who was just on the left... Oh, Don Jose? I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Um, oh, what about these? I don't know if I should... Remember the blue medallions, guys? If you don't, I'll read it to you now. Fifteen blue medallions. This, this plus ten. Seven in the farm, eight in the cemetery. For those of you who destroy ten or more will be rewarded. Awarded, sorry. It should be rewarded, not awarded. <laughs> the rest is, elig is eligible. The rest is eligible. What does that even mean? Okay, whatever. It's weird. I pushed the square button. That's confirmed. I hope you guys are all doing well. Let's go ahead and kill Don... No, this is Don Jose. What are their names? I forgot their names. I, I pointed them out in the last video when I completed it. Let's just ambush this guy. Leon! Oh, that was close. Yeah, just get him in the... Get him in the knee. That was close. Okay. We're still sticking by what we said, guys. We're still doing knife only here. Um, I hope we can find some health or something like that soon. We're getting money, so... We might be able to sell some of our assets out to the, uh, the merchant. Leon, look to the right. Is there somebody there? There is. Oh my god, Leon. Thank you. You saved my life. You saved your life. Let's go ahead and take care of this guy. Uh, no, the ladder's in the way. No! <sighs> Come on, Leon. Get him. Nice. Very nice knife skills. Always gotta watch your back. Alright, got some more money. Let's take it slow here, guys. Let's take it very slow. Let's take it very slow. I have a feeling I'm gonna have my hand on, on my sh on my stomach like this whole playthrough, man. Leon's gonna be running around with freaking diarrhea the whole time. <laughs> the whole freaking game. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. Oh, thank God. Grab me. <sighs> that was so close. Thank God he didn't grab me the other way. Okay. Um. <gasps> Guys. I'm going to unpause it. I don't want to use my healing items yet. If I get hit... Ooh, okay, we're, we're good. No, the cow's in the way! I don't want to hit the cow. Damn you. Putting a cow in the way. Yeah. Alright. Alright, Esteban. Come on, man. There you go. Shit, shit, shit. Back off, back off. There we go. Kick him! Oh my god. Guys, we got this down. And I know I'm kind of wasting time here, but I'm kind of practicing my knife skills here. I'm not going to cheat and like and like play off the camera so you guys won't see it. I want the experience to be as real as possible. I want you guys to be here the whole way. I forgot about a treasure. Guys, I forgot about a treasure. There is a bunch of dead bodies here. Okay, um, that's not important. What is important is the treasure- Wolf! Hi! 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 How are- okay. Uh, yes, the cow's here. The cows are, uh, cowy. Hello. You're on a farm- okay. Guys. Uh... 
All right, so there is, yeah, this very disgusting water. But there's a medallion there. The problem is, if you shoot it down, it'll fall into the water. Can I hit it with the knife? <laughs> you see that board there? Right there? I want to hit that, so that way... It, oh, but I... You know what? You know what? Get the... Get, get the... Come on, Leon, just... Oh, just, just lean over the thing and grab it. Just lean over... Okay, fine. You know what? Spare me this one bullet, guys, okay? <laughs> Spare me this one bullet, guys, okay? Spare me this, these two bullets, okay? Three bullets. There we go. Jesus Christ. Alright, put the gun away. Man. We're, not, we're not allowed to, to use that anymore. We have 1% health right now. <laughs> if somebody breathes on us, we're dead. These cows could probably kill us. Okay, let's go ahead and... Oh! Oh, there's a, there's a treasure here. Can I break it open with my... um? No. Okay, I'm gonna use this grenade. I really hope this works. Yes, it did work. Awesome. There's a treasure back here. And here it is. Ah. The beer stein. Or beer stain. I think it's beer stain. I'm not sure. I don't use that word. Uh, so, I have no idea. Uh, oh, we need to go up here. That's right. We need to go up here. Because we're heading to the church where we can get Ashley, the president's daughter. <laughs> and we're gonna have some fun with her, if you know what I mean. And no, I don't mean it like that, you freaking idiot. I mean, like, we're gonna... kill her a lot. And she's gonna... <gasps> and it's gonna be funny. Like I said before, my closest friends know that I am very bad when it comes to handling Ashley. I'm not like that with partners in real life, just saying. Uh, let's go ahead and continue here. Let's go ahead and continue. All right, great. So I'm empty. Does, oh, you can't, you can't do the thing. Oh, that's what I was gonna tell you guys. All right, so there is a technique that started, originated in this game, that I think a friend of mine, I don't, I don't know if it has an official term, but it's called aim snapping, right? Basically, what you do is you can move your camera with the right stick, right? If you aim in a certain direction and then, if you aim the camera in a certain direction, so then tap the aim button, you'll immediately pwa swap and, and uh, turn and face that direction, which is an excellent way of doing fake outs. Things like be like, oh, there's an enemy right there. Whoop. Oh, now I'm facing this direction. Or, Whoop. Oh, now I'm going this way. Or, yeah, like that. Great way of getting around enemies very quickly. Great way of changing your direction, especially with grenades. Very, very, very helpful, especially on the Wii version where you can actually aim before you even aim with the Wii remote. At Resident Evil 5, it was, it was in Resident Evil 5 too. And uh, it was even more... Uh, Oh no, reload. Reload, Leon! Another missed shot. It was even more uh, quick, it was even quicker. Uh, if you use controls types either A or D, I want, I want, no, C or D, sorry. If you use control type C or D, it will use a camera system very similar to this game, and you're able to do the aim snapping like this, and there too. In the versus mode in that game, Knowing how to aim snap is an absolute necessity. It'll help you dodge enemy bullets. It'll help you dodge uh, Magini attacks. You you basically need it. I've seen the signpost before. Oh yeah yeah, it's boulder time, guys. There's a there's a boulder, right there. Do you see that? We're about to be chased by it. So here we go. All right, what button do we have to push? I think it's square. Is it, is it square? Square? Square. Okay. Yeah, they're not they're not gonna catch me. They're not gonna catch me. Yeah. You know how fast I'm hitting this button? You hear that? And what's the button? Oh my god, I hit my microphone. Sorry, guys. But we made it. We're safe. Uh, good. Let's continue going. There's treasures up here. You know what? As long as I don't shoot any enemies, I think it's fine. We can use it like for treasures and stuff, but shooting enemies, that's not acceptable. All right? Can we make that deal? Can we make that deal? Can we, can we do that? Will you guys accept that, please? Yeah? Well... I'm going to assume you guys are nice and say yes anyway, even though you may or may not. Again, the same signpost, yes. Everybody here has dynamite, so it'll... Oh, force of habit, force of habit. Oh my god, force of habit. I almost shot a bullet at that guy. I almost lost the challenge. Buddy. Oh, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine. All right, yeah. Grab me, come on, grab me. 
Ooh, never mind. Somebody threw something. Okay, we're fine. Ooh, all right. There is a treasure here. Get it. Ah, get it. Get it. Nice. We got the cat's eye. That goes into the beer steam. Beer stein. Beer. Which I'm gonna call it? No, Leon. Okay. Let's just run into this house. What? Dude, stay the hell away from me, man. Stay away. Look, I'm just going into my house. 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 That's it, man. I don't want what you're selling. I don't want what you're selling. I don't want what you're selling. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Wow. Uh, I thought for sure I was screwed. <laughs> we made it. Oh, my God. Guys, I thought for sure the dynamite was gonna kill me, or either the dynamite was gonna trigger this, which would then kill me. But neither of those things happened. Oh god. Uh, can I get this money without triggering the thing? Can I get it? Okay. There's an herb! There's an herb in there! There's an herb in there, but the Leon doesn't know how to duck yet. He doesn't know how to duck or crawl or do any of that stuff. Can I, I can waste the bullet, right? I can shoot the bullet. I, I'm allowed. I'm allowed. I'm allowed to do that. We're allowed to do that. We're allowed to use the gun if it gets in the way of things, but we cannot shoot enemies. That's that's what we're doing here, right? We cannot shoot enemies. I'm gonna go ahead and refill my health by combining these two. There we go. And since my health isn't at the maximum level, it does refill completely at uh with just two herbs. Uh, that doesn't open. And it's time to meet Louis Sarah. Here we go. The Spaniard. The Spaniard scientist slash former cop. Well, no, you're not, you don't. A uh, little rough, don't you think? Uh, you're not like them? No. You? Okay. I have only one very important question. You got a smoke? Got gum. Bubble gum. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm using Perfect. a pink controller, don't judge. The big cheese. I, I happen to think this looks like a very nice controller. I, I think this is a very... It's Pitoris Mendez! Guys, it's the village chief. He's no joke. I rest my case. Alright. That was chapter 1-1. We didn't even beat the chapter the first time, the first episode. So we're in chapter 1-2 now. Holy crap. Feeble humans. Let us give you our power. Sell it. <laughs> Sadler! Soon, you will become unable to resist this intoxicating power guys is it me or does Sadler have like the most seductive voice ever <laughs> man in Resident Evil you have Leon you have Ada and then you have Sadler hey, on the sexy up? scale okay <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. crawl out of one hole and into another you want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Oh, hey, easy, whoever you are. <sighs> Name's Leon. Came here looking for this girl. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? <laughs> you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. She's the president's daughter? <laughs> That's too good for a guess. Wanna start explaining? Psychic powers. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. It's Don Jose. <laughs> He's back for revenge. <laughs> After the 50 and times I killed him. Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid, but now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite the ladies' man. Why'd you quit? <laughs> Policia. Bug. You put your life on the line, 
nobody really appreciates you enough for it. It's a Reaper, guys. It's a freaking Reaper from Resident Evil 5. Not to be anymore. <laughs> Used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? What's going I on in this town? A sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Oh. Hey boy, I'm not dying. Okay. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. QT. QT. After you. Now you gave me too much time. I thought this was professional mode. Oh God, poor Don Jose. It's Leon. Sorry I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was a bit tied up. You're okay, right? I'm fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. What happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No. But apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm heading back to the village. Alright, we're gonna do a lot of running in this section, guys, because this part's very combat heavy. Um, we're also about to run into probably one of the most, if not the most famous Resident Evil characters in Resident Evil history. No, it's not Barry Burton. No, it's not Jill Valentine. <laughs> no, it's not Claire Redfield. No, it's not Albert Wesker. It's the one, the only, merch over here. Oh man, I'm so excited to see this guy again. I haven't seen him in years. Alright. Okay. So here we go. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Yes, I know all his lines. Look at this. What are you what buying? Are you buying? What, are you what are you buying? buying? What, are you, what selling? are you selling? Is that, Is that old, old stranger? stranger? Check this out. Ah, ah I'll, I'll buy it at a high price. price. And then I'll sell it. And it'll be like, <laughs> <laughs> thank, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Okay. Now, we'll sell Is these. <laughs> uh, thank you. Sell the ah. shotgun. Uh, Thanks, sell the rifle ammo, sell the shotgun shells, we'll Thanks. keep the handgun ammo for now, just in case, um, yes, now, what are you buying? I'm wondering, I'm wondering if I should upgrade my handgun, because like, one boss keeps popping into my head, that I know for certain you need a gun to kill, and for people who have played this game, you know who he is, He's got white hair, he's got a blue jacket, <laughs> a blue hat, he laughs like this, <laughs> right? You need a gun to kill him. I, th I think I should upgrade the gun, I really think I should, so I'll, I'll just upgrade the firepower, but keep everything else the same, because um, I'm going to need the gun to fight him. There won't be any need to upgrade the attache case, buy these, please buy these. Um... There we go. Thank you. Is there anything else here? No, there's really nothing else. I mean, there's no point in buying a bigger attache case because we don't need it. So, that's really it. All right. Wow. <laughs> this is going to be crazy. Oh, red herb, thank God. All right, let's go ahead and mix these. Nice. We mixed the herbs. Now we have a red and green herb. We just have to find some yellow herbs. Yellow herbs are going to be our savior here in this playthrough. They really, really are. Because by the time we get towards the end of the game... and Look at this! Look at this wide open area with freaking tons of enemies. And there's more than they show here. They just keep coming and coming and coming and coming and spawning and spawning. We're just going to have to run past them. Enough. On your knees, damn it. Alright, that's good enough too. Just got to be careful. Just got to be careful. Uh... Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Uh, run around them. Run around. Get the door. Shit, I 
cut. I, I, I didn't think that animation would count, but it did. Uh, get inside. Oh my. Oh god. Uh, up the ladder. Leon, Leon. Okay. All right. There's there's the first piece. There's the first piece. Get it. Leon, get the get the get the get the. Okay. Get the, okay. Jump down. Jump down. Wow. Over here. Oh, shit. Okay. Um. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Yes. Yes. Toss dynamite. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, um, run, run the circles. Wait, wait, this isn't where I can go. I can't go this way. I can't go this way. Oh my god. Look at this guy. He's freaking throwing dynamite everywhere. Okay. I can't. I can't do it. Save, save, save the... Yeah, go, go, go. Get down. Get down. I really... Oh my... No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Just please tell me there's something in there. Yes! Yes! That's what I was looking for. Okay, get down. Mm -mm. Good, good, good. Oh my, oh my god, oh. Dynamite help! No. Ah, oh, no, we're, we're already losing so much help. No, 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 no. Yes. Yes. No, no. 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 Oh my god, right, use it, use it, use the frickin'. Get. Mm. Nine hundred dollars, not worth it. Come on, go. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know if I should be fighting them. But I, feel, I can't spend this whole playthrough just running around. What? Mm. Come on. That's it. You guys piss me off now. I'm ready to fight you. Stop grabbing me, you piece of junk. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe that wasn't the best idea. Maybe, maybe, maybe I should just run. Maybe, you know what? Everything's gonna be fine. Hey, Don Esteban, stay back there, man. Listen, I... Hi. Greetings. No, no one's coming this Okay, well. Uh, wait a minute. Am I blocking the door? Oh, I guess I was. Oh my god. Mm. No, Leon, come on, you gotta- Oh my- Look at how many of them there are! Mm. Mm. Okay, good. Mm. We're doing this Mortal Kombat style, like we're fighting on the pit. Oh god. Oh god, no. Hey, buddy, dynamite guy, throw- throw- throw, throw some dynamite. Throw some dynamite. Yes. Okay, um, ba bad strategy. That's a very bad strategy. Okay, um, wait, do I have to interact with the merchant again? Over here, straight. I guess I do. I, I guess. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Yes, yes, he's a merchant. Good, 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 great, 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 Just like that. Why couldn't I have done that the first time? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Why didn't you do that the first time? I don't know. I don't know why. I, I don't know why I didn't do it the first time. It's fine. Everything's fine. Just like in the HD Resident Evil Resident Evil HD Remaster. Um nah, Resident Evil HD Resident 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 Leon the Barrel! Resident Evil 
HD remaster, a remaster of a remake, on the PlayStation 4, 1080p, 30 frames per second. Mmm. Alright, can, can we, can we not, can we not, can we, can we please not? Watch your friend, just, just sit there and watch your friend die. Oh, shit. Shit. Perfect, that was perfect, that couldn't have gone any better. Hit all three of them, man. Hit all three of them, hit all three of them. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, triple kill, triple kill, yes! Nice work, Leon. Very good, very good. Alright, let's, uh... Where did my green and red herbs go? I never picked them up, oh, shit. Um, yeah, I know, the, the, the mask, I gotta get the mask, I gotta get the mask, uh, eh. jump through. Ooh! Okay. Alright, I somehow gotta get these guys to, like, throw it at themselves. Oh, shit. Did that work? Did that work? Did that work? I think it worked. I think that killed them. What a bunch of dumbasses. Okay, open this oven. Grab the spinal, sp spinel, whatever you want to call it. Alright, here we go. Grab that one. ka -chow. Uh, right here, like that. Don't stuff the bear traps. La Kalula Lili Balu. Oh, here it is. Yep, elegant mask. It'd be funny if you could actually, like, wear the treasures that you pick up with Leon. Like, you get one of those rings and you, like, actually. You get one of those rings and you actually put it on. Let me see if I can find a green herb. No? Okay, I gotta use the first aid spray then. <laughs> like, you got Leon running around with a ring and a crown and <laughs> that mask. Good job falling on your back, buddy. Oh, I'm so sorry, man. How many times have I. Alright, you know what? That's fine. We'll have it for next time. Just combine them. Combine them. I can't wait till we get to our first boss battle, guys. And I guess, well, I don't know. The first boss battle technically is Del Lago, but you can't really just fight him with a knife. You're wasting time with your rhetoric. Uh oh, you, you gonna drop something? Can I? Thank you. Ultimate fishing time. Go! <sighs> time to commit some fish genocide. Uh, uh, yes. Yes, look at these skills. Look at these fishing skills. Come on. Hmm. What, what do you think you're doing? Oh, that's right. What are you talking about? These fish are bad guys. They're infected with the T-Virus. That's why I'm killing them. They're infected with the T-Virus. These are not innocent fish. I mean, I don't want to... I don't want to just kind of leave them like... Oh, double kill. Nice. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I was, I was wrong. Hmm. 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 Leon, come on. Come on, Leon. Come on, Leon. Show us your inner fisherman. Show us your inner fisherman. Come on, Leon. Look, this one's trapped in the corner. He's all yours. Uh. What? What? He just revived himself! Come on! Come oh my god, stop. Mm. Yeah, I hit you a bunch of times that time. Okay. Look, now we have all these fish. <laughs> we got a ton of healing. Look. I, I feel really bad all of a sudden. Like, I just... I, I just killed that fish's family. Listen. Listen, I would ask for the same thing, okay? Let, let me just kill you. So that way you could join your family in heaven. In fish heaven. Okay? Listen, it'll all be over soon. Just, 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 come on. Listen. The grieving process. There. Okay. Okay, we got all the fish. Ooh. One, two, three, four fish, and a giant black bass. Playing this game as if it's Metal Gear Solid 3. <laughs> oh, right, I forgot about this part. All right, there's another one of these here. Bam, bam, bam. There we go. Reload. Okay. 
Does this signpost mean more booby trap? <laughs> I love your thinking, Leon. Uh, more money. More money means more merchant. Here we go. Oh, crow. I scared the crap out of me. For some reason, I thought I was playing like one of the older Resident Evil games where the crows actually attack you. <laughs> it's not like that in this game. Oh. Oh god, guys, it's like it's like the scariest puzzle ever. Damn, I'm doing it the wrong way. <laughs> I think I think at the least you can complete that puzzle in just two moves. Right, I know there's money in here. I think this is Chief Mendez's room. But I don't think this bed is big enough for him. I mean, he leaves his note here. All right. As instructed by Lord Sadler, I have the agent in confinement alive. Why keep him alive? I don't fully understand what the Lord's intentions are. I would, however, think he'd keep them separate, not confine them together as has been ordered. I don't expect Lewis... I don't expect Lewis would be a trusting... Would be... I don't expect Lewis would trust a stranger, but if by chance they did cooperate, the situation could get a bit more complicated. If for some reason an unknown third party is involved, like Wesker. I don't think they'd let a chance like this slip by. But maybe it's all Lord Sadler's ploy, leaving us vulnerable so that this third party will surface. If they even exist, that is. It's an unlikely possibility, but if a prowler is already amongst us, then our plans could be ruined. I guess the Lord thinks it's worth the risk if we're able to stop whatever conspiracy is at work. At any rate, it's the Lord's call. We will trust his judgment as always, because we are mindless human beings controlled by a parasite. Let's grab this key. <laughs> Imagine if imagine how cool it would be if like all the parasites just stopped working and everyone was like, "Oh my god. Where am I?" <laughs> and then and then Leon Leon just starts running around. He's aiming at everybody and everyone's like, "Wait, don't shoot." And then Leon's like, "Huh?" And then they're like, "What are you doing in our village?" And Leon's like, "I'm here to rescue the president's daughter." And they're like, "I know where she is. She's in that church. Let us help you." <laughs> and then Leon's like, "What?" Oh yeah, Leon. Leon's infected. You carry the same blood as us, it seems. Nevertheless, you're an outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. <laughs> oh, what? Same blood. Yeah. Obviously, it's... What is it? I think it's called Dramatic Irony, where the audience knows what's going on, but the character doesn't. Obviously, Leon doesn't know that he was infected with the parasite when he was unconscious. He doesn't know about that. But we do. So that's where the cool part comes in. Um, I'm going to go ahead and play to the next typewriter just so I could extend this gameplay just a little bit longer because I know uh, I'm not able to pump these out every single day like I was able to with the Resident Evil HD remaster. Um, the semester is getting crazier now. And uh, with, with the newspaper work and all that, so I'm gonna try to make the episodes longer. Leon, I've been able to get some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Apparently, there's a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? <laughs> That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had an unexpected run in with the big cheese of this village. But you're okay, right? <sighs> yeah, but he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. Carry the same blood. Huh. Interesting. Anyway, there are more important things than solving riddles right now. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. Yeah. There are more important things solving than solving riddles, considering we're in a Resident Evil game, right? You don't solve riddles in Resident Evil games. <laughs> Welcome to Ooh. Jesus Christ, I bet that hurt. <laughs> Dude, this guy's like freaking seven feet tall, just just freaking holding Leon down. Hey dog! I'm sorry, I, I had to. She just Batmaned her way out of there. Technically, back row. Look at, look at Leo's face. He's like, what the f just happened? <laughs> okay. Oh, right. We can look out the window. 
Woman in Red. Somehow so familiar. Oh yeah, like I like you don't remember this woman who was in red who like you fell in love with during the destruction of Raccoon City and all that. You don't remember any of that, obviously. Oh, there's a typewriter right here. All right, guys. Well, I know there's a Dr. Salvador outside. And I feel like we might as well have one last battle before we end this episode. So we'll go ahead and do that. First off, let's peep in on, uh, Doc, on Esteban here. Yeah, yeah, man. I wanted to see your thing. Oh, Jesus. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, no, Leon. Mm. There we go. Did you hear what I just said like 10 seconds ago? I can't believe I just said that. Good lord. Yeah, yeah, man, I wanted to see your thing. Jesus Christ, he peed all over it. He didn't even he didn't even aim straight at the hole. He just he just aimed upwards and just went <laughs> Looks like they use toilets. I guess they're at least somewhat civilized. See that's really that's really the uh the sad thing about this game when you really think about it is that Well, I don't want to spoil anything. I'll tell you more about it in the credits, because the credits really does a good job of showing the downfall of these people. Much like Raccoon City, they were just afflicted of this thing just pretty much out of nowhere. They had no control over it. It just it was just a disaster that happened to them. So, you know, it was what it was. Uh, but we'll get more into that later. As the story progresses, we'll start to learn how these people turned into these... Uh, you know, mindless zombies, pretty much. These uh, voodoo mind-controlled zombies who just want to kill Leon. Uh, so we'll get into that soon. Wow, we're only on chapter 1-3, and there are five chapters altogether in this game. Each chapter, I think, has five sections in it. So we still have quite a ways to go. Uh, as you can see, guys, uh, our old friend Dr. Salvador is here because we didn't kill him last time. Well, he, he'd be here anyway, but the doctor is in. Uh, we should be okay. We should be fine. We just got to make sure we get Don Esteban here. Oh, and Don Jose. I should have let him go. Bam. Nice. This is all going very well. Okay. Keep your distance, Jose. Keep your distance. Whoa, that was... You know what? No. We're having a round two. That's it. Best two out of three, man. Best two out of three. Come on. Come on. Hmm, right. I'm ready for you this time. Come on, Doc. Come on, Doc. Yeah. I have a taste of my health insurance. Oh my god. Yes. Yes. Oh my god, I just alerted everyone else. Okay. Hit him, hit him. One, two, three, four. Shit! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> this good to crap. Okay, um. Oh. Oh, use the egg. Use the egg. Side, Leon. Get inside. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, he broke the door down. Great. Dude! Is this how it's gonna be? I'm gonna die in the bathroom? Get out of here! You know what? Die. Freaking, freaking die. Just get out of here. Nobody wants you. Yo, <laughs> yo, putting it all on the line, putting it all on the line, putting it all on the yes! Oh, we did it, guys, we won. Give me that ruby. What? Okay, alright, guys, so I'm gonna... <laughs>
I'm going to go ahead and end the episode now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Good to see you guys after a week. Now, I wanted, I wanted to uh, actually ask you guys something really quick. Uh, I kind of like the format that I had last week, where I would make an episode of Resident Evil 4 and then make a kind of random gameplay episode uh, to add to my gameplay collection, the, the playlist that I... Oh, my God. The <laughs> playlist that I have here on YouTube. And, uh, well, no, I'll load this back up because that was the peaceful music. Uh, but what do you guys think of that? Would you like to have a Resident Evil 4 episode and then a random gameplay episode, probably like Saturday, Sunday? Or would you prefer to have two episodes of Resident Evil 4? Um, let me know, so that way for next week I'll be able to plan ahead. Uh, I'll put that question in the comments below just to remind everybody again and in the description too. Uh, of this video so definitely let me know and uh, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you next time look forward to the next episode which will be coming next week um, I'm gonna go ahead and record another random gameplay I don't know what I'm gonna play just yet but I guess you'll find out soon if not the video's already uploaded I don't know we'll see the, the schedule's weird and stuff but hope you guys have a good day I love you guys thanks for stopping by and I'll see you next time have a good one